Hey guys, it's Destiny Lachey. In today's video, I'm gonna be telling you moms out there some of the products that I feel like my newborn actually uses. Cause I feel like there's so many products out there that you don't really need when you have a baby. So I was like, let me make a video because many unnecessary products that you really don't even need to put on your registry or even need to purchase at all cause you won't use them. First product that I use all the time for my newborn, my baby's two months tomorrow. I can't believe it, I really can't believe it. First product I use all the time that she's actually in right now is the baby swing. I feel like I could not live without that baby swing. I don't know how people do it without the baby swing, honestly. I get so much done with Leela being in the baby swing, it's crazy. Most of the time she sleeps in there, she takes naps in there. Um, of course at night she sleeps in the room with me, but when I need to clean or make Leilani some food, Leela is in that swing and she loves it. She falls asleep every time because it's like that rocking motion. And I love that the swing that we have, it turns so that she can swing like this as well as like this, so the other way. So I really love the swing. I would pay like $500 for a swing if it was good because it gives you so much of a needed like break because you don't wanna hold your baby all the time. Like I love my baby, don't get me wrong, but I just don't wanna hold her all the time because you actually do have to do other things. All right, so the next product that I really love and I use all the time is this Baby Nest. I got this one off of Amazon, no, I got this off of Etsy. I shop on Amazon all the time too, but this one I got off of Etsy. It's so cute, it has a little frillies on it and it's super girly. And it's like a nude color, which I really love for baby stuff for some reason. But I got this off of Etsy. I think it was less than $50. I love it. I use it all the time. I actually put this in her bed because it fits perfectly in there. And I also bring this around the house with me if she's taking a nap or if she's sleepy because it's really comfortable. It's like a little portable baby mattress. So even if you are traveling or something like that, you can take this with you. This is really something that I use all the time. It was not a waste of money whatsoever. I love, love, love it. And it does have handles or a handle so that you can carry it, but it's really light and easy to carry and travel with. So I really like this. Very good investment. So the next product is the side sleeper. So I love my side sleeper. I was debating on getting a crib for Leela, but at the end of the day, I was like, I don't think I'll use a crib. I feel like it's a waste of money. I didn't use a crib with Leilani, so why would I use it with my second kid? So I ended up getting a side sleeper, and the little baby nest fits perfectly inside the side sleeper. And the bedside sleeper actually can connect to the bed. You can let the sides down, and you can just push it against the bed so that your baby is technically sleeping with you but in a crib at the same time. So I really love that instead of getting a crib. It really is nice because it connects right to the bed and it's very sleep friendly and safe for the baby to sleep next to you. If you do want to co-sleep, definitely get one of the bedside sleepers. Okay, so the next products are products that I use to like care for Leela. So I really love diaper creams and I've tried so many diaper creams because Leela is prone to getting redness in her diaper area as well as like her backside. So I'm always looking for a good diaper cream. Um, with Leilani, I use the Barrado's butt paste and I love it. Um, I still love this for Leela, um, but one of my friends told me about the Desitin Multi-Purpose Healing Ointment. This stuff is great as well as the butt paste if your baby is prone to getting diaper rash or if your baby does have diaper rash. So I use this every diaper change because this is like a petroleum based protectant um, if you want to prevent diaper rash and the Baradol's butt paste is something that you use to get rid of diaper rash. So if she does have a diaper rash and it just won't go away, it's really stubborn, I'll go ahead and slap this on and about two or three diapers it'll be almost gone. This also works on baby acne as well. So if your baby is breaking out on their face, I'm not a doctor, like I like to try things on my kid, obviously safe things, but I tried this on her face for her baby acne and it worked great. Um, it, it's zinc oxide. A lot of people use this for acne, like diaper cream for acne. So I decided to just put it on her face one day and it dried up. She had like, honestly, her face, I'll put a picture, her face was really covered in a lot of little acne bumps and after I used this, it cleared right up after like four or five days. So 
I really like this for her face as well. Um, the next product that I use, this is kind of like ghetto, but <laughs> like this little packaging, but I love to use shea butter on my baby. This is the only thing that I use to lotion her body with is shea butter. This is my little travel version. I kind of melted it and put it into this container so I could take it with me. I bought like a 10 pound thing of shea butter a long long time ago and I still have it because I love shea butter I use it on myself my husband uses it Leela uses it Leilani uses it like my whole family uses shea butter so we bought so much of it I love using it on Leela it's a natural product that just helps get rid of eczema it just helps like nourish the skin it's so great she hasn't had any reactions to shea butter at all whatsoever. After she gets out the bathtub, I just lather her in shea butter and she smells so good. Her skin is so baby smooth after I put it on. It's, she's already a baby. Her baby skin is already smooth, but you know, shea butter just makes you even smoother. So I love using that on her. It's the only moisturizer I use on her body, like after the bath and even on a daily basis when I don't give her a bath. I throw her on some shea butter because it's just a nice natural moisturizer. So I love shea butter for my baby's lotion. So recently we had a problem with Leela's neck being very bumpy um, because water and throw up and saliva gets under her neck. It gets really gross. Honestly, she had like little white pus filled bumps under her neck. And I was really concerned because I thought it was like yeast or something like that. I didn't know what to do. So I did a little research and I found that a lot of people would use cornstarch under the baby's neck. So I was like, let me just try that out and see if that works. But my husband went to the store and purchased this Johnson & Johnson's um, Aloe Vitamin E powder. This is a cornstarch based powder. I was looking for something specifically that used cornstarch as a base instead of talc because talc can be harming to the baby. So I didn't want any talc powder. This is a cornstarch based powder. And when I tell you, I put this under Leela's neck one night and the next morning her neck was clear, like it was scabby. It was amazing. So I feel like just because there was so much moisture underneath her neck and she's a little chubby, so she kind of like has no neck, <laughs> It all the moisture just got trapped under there and it needed something to kind of soak up that moisture so those bumps can't live put this on her every diaper change under her neck and it works like a charm so one day I was looking at Leela's scalp and I discovered that she has really 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 dry scalp a lot of newborns go through this um, and I really wanted something that could scrub away all the dead skin off of her scalp without hurting her so my one of my friends told me about this scalp scrubby and this is a really gentle scrubber to get off any dead skin all over their body, especially on their scalp. I use this in the bathtub as well as when she gets out of the bathtub just to get some of the dry skin off of her body. I feel like it really builds up on her scalp and this works so well. I got this off Amazon and it comes in a pack of three. It's not that expensive and it's very gentle on their little body. So this works great and when you use it, it gets up so much of the dead skin and stuff like that. So I really think this is a good thing to invest in and it's not that expensive either. So another thing that I use every single day without a doubt is my boppy pillow. I breastfeed with this. I put Leela in this to do some neck time like on her belly. I sit her on her back in this. She can kind of sit up a little bit now like with the pillow. So I use this for almost everything pertaining to Leela. It's just so comfortable for her and for me when I'm breastfeeding. Also use this when I I was uh, postpartum when I couldn't really sit on my you know butt area <laughs> because it was really sore so I used to sit on this because I couldn't sit like directly on chairs all the time I would use this and just sit on it when I was holding her and stuff like that this is great this is definitely something that I use every single day okay so I would say a newborn does not need that many clothes Leela does not own one pair of shoes I don't think I did not purchase her any shoes because this being my second kid I know 
what Leela would need and what she wouldn't need. So what I've been putting her in lately, because we've been in the house and we've been quarantined anyway, I've been using these little dress sleepers all the time. She's been in these constantly. They're so easy to like open up and change her diaper. And they're really comfortable for her because her little feet can stick out of these. And it just makes it really easy for us to change her as well. And most of these have the little hand things so that she doesn't scratch her face because she has really long nails all the time even if I cut them they're really sharp and she will attack her own face and then she'll cry <laughs> I love using these this is something that I definitely put on her every single day so another product that I do use a lot I would say every other day are the swaddles now Leilani my older kid did not like swaddles whatsoever she hated them but Leela loves to be snuggled up and swaddled so we get these pre-made swaddles that have velcro on them and when she gets out the bathtub we just wrap her in these because she's really fussy and she just wants to feed after she gets out the bath and you don't really want to to put the baby on so many clothes after getting them out of the bath because Leela, I don't know about your newborn, but my newborn does not like putting on complicated clothes and honestly, I don't like putting them on her either. Uh, only sometimes when we're like going out or doing something, but other than that, after the bath, she's already fussy. I just wanna wrap her up and let her feed and let her go to sleep. So she loves these little swaddles. So if your baby likes to be swaddled, definitely get some pre made swaddles if you haven't had your baby yet only get one or two don't over buy swaddles because you don't know if your baby will like them or not so yeah these i use every other day for her so something else that i didn't really think about this time around but i already had from leilani are burp cloths this one is actually a cloth diaper and i feel like the cloth diapers are so much better as burp cloths than burp cloths like actual burp cloths. These work great as burp cloths. They're really thick. I feel like this has like five layers of fabric through it. It's so thick because it's meant to be a cloth diaper. You can use these as cloth diapers too. Like when she gets a little bit older, I am gonna start cloth diapering. But right now I'm using these as burp cloths and I love the color of them. They're neutral, of course. I love like a nude color. I already explained it. I like nude color baby stuff. <laughs> so this goes great with like my baby aesthetic that I don't really have, but whatever. <laughs> but I love these because they're really thick and no throw up goes through them and they're really easy to clean. I do have makeup on them because I wiped my face earlier, but these are great. And I think they come in a pack of 10 or more. They're a little expensive, but they're so worth it. These were actually Leilani's and we just are using them for Leela, but I love them. And the last item is something that I never thought about before having kids. Like I never really thought that this would be necessary at all. We use these blue pads every single day. So I remember when I used to work with like older people and you had to change them a lot and they would soil the bed, we would have to put these on their bed so that the pee wouldn't go through to the bed. This is like a diaper kind of material on the front and then on the back it's a blue plastic so that the pee or the poop doesn't go through. So what we do with this is we put this on her changing table. So when we're changing her, if she pees or she poops, we don't have to change the changing cover on the changing table, it's great. So if she pees or she poops, so if she pees or she poops, this just protects the changing pad so that we don't have to change it so often and it just catches all her pee and her poop and we can just ball this up and throw it out. It's just so easy and it just makes life so much cleaner. Like, I never would have thought of that at all, but these work so great. I don't know where we got those from, but I'm pretty sure you can get them on Amazon. I know some people use them for their pets as well, but I use them for my kid. So I think that's the last thing, guys. I think that's the last thing. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do want me to do like a newborn morning routine or a newborn night routine, I would love to do that. So just let me know in the comments if you want to see it. Let me know what your favorite baby items are down below in the comments. If you have a newborn and there are some items that I need to know about, let me know, sis, okay? Because I'm here for buying baby stuff, okay? Only if I need it, though. Only if I need it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!